Live from the KXLY4 HD Broadcast Center with the only local news at 6.30. You're watching KXLY4 HD News. 35 major roof collapses in Spokane and many more in surrounding areas. And local building inspectors say in the next couple of days things will likely get worse. More buildings will fall. KXLY 4's McKay Allen is live with us tonight. And McKay, the concern is now our homes. That's exactly right. To this point, we've seen mostly commercial buildings with large flat roofs uh, that have fallen. But now, because of the rain, because of the wind, authorities tell us they're very concerned about our homes. It's at a critical point where you really need to evaluate your roof. No question the roof collapses we've seen have been severe and unprecedented. And I've been with the city 19 years and I've never seen anything like this. But to this point, flat-roofed commercial buildings have been the predominant victims. Some of them are just older buildings that are, uh, that are just not failing under the weight. But this rain could serve to widen the scope of damage. Initially, there's going to be some weight on there, so I think we're, until we really get a good melt on those, I think it's going to add a little. The problem? The existing snow could act as a sponge, sucking up the rain and increasing roof loads. And for the hundreds of buildings that are already precariously close to collapse, building officials say this rain could push them right over the edge. So yeah, I'm very concerned. The next couple of days I think are going to be, be critical. Joe Weisner, Spokane's director of buildings, says we're entering almost entirely into uncharted waters. There's really no way to know if commercial or residential roofs can withstand the weight. Really check your building for where it's leaking or if you're getting cracking, tweaking, or, or any signs that something's stressing. And get the snow off. Water has to get off the roof. If that water's staying on the roof, whether it melts or not, it's still, that's still weight, whether it's in ice, snow, or water. Wisner's main worry, the wrong roof will collapse at the wrong time. What's really amazing is, as far as I know, no one has been hurt in these, in these collapses. Now the weight load requirement for roofs in Spokane is uh, 30 pounds per square foot. Uh, the issue and the concern a lot of people have is many of the roofs that have collapsed have not yet reached that 30 uh, pounds per square foot, yet they've still collapsed. The real problem will be when and if uh, the weight reaches 30 pounds per square foot. People are very concerned that, as we said, not only uh, commercial structures, but residential buildings, homes will collapse then. Reporting live, McKay Allen, KXOY 4HD News.